Namaste and welcome to day 4 of the Anxiety Relief Series. I hope you all benefited from all the videos that we have done in this series. And today we will be working on our heart chakra, the fourth chakra. It is called Anahat Chakra in Hindi. The heart chakra is responsible for your passion and also the way you connect with the world in terms of love and responsiveness. It is the chakra that is responsible for how you give and receive love. Most of all are quite comfortable with the way we give love. We know how to show our love to other people. But the most important thing which has been the root cause of many issues people carry on is we do not know how to receive love. Even if somebody is expressing their love for us, we are not in the state where we can accept it and use it in our life. It is these small things that keep creating blockages in our energy flow and over a period of time it creates a state where we feel disheartened or disconnected with all the people who are around us. So today we will try and release any heaviness in our heart chakra and open ourselves to the world, to the love, not only from the living beings but also the non-living beings for example, the nature, the objects in your house, and everything that comes in your contact. So for this, we will take our totem, our rock or crystal, keep it in our right hand and put it in our lap like this. We will chant our mantra, which is Ahim, and you can keep doing it silently or out loud. And while doing it, make sure you're not disturbed for a few minutes. So be in a very comfortable and a calm environment. Now with each mantra, I want you to visualize that you are really opening up your heart chakra and letting all the painful memories come out. It is okay for now to think of the hard times that you've had or the pain that you had been storing in your heart for the longest time. But try and release it slowly and gradually. Allow me to guide you through this meditation Relax your hands in your lap and let's begin. Close your eyes. Draw in a deep breath in and hold it. And exhale, relaxing your shoulders and your neck. Draw another deep breath in. Hold it. And again, exhaling and relaxing your body even more and more. And now take another deep breath in. Hold it. Let it circulate in your entire body. And exhale and relax. Now let your body continue breathing easily and effortlessly. Thank your body for this wonderful process of breathing in which you do not have to care of how you take the breath in and out but it continues to do its work perfectly without failure. And now let's begin with relaxing our feet, our right foot, our left foot Relax the muscles, any stress in this area from walking or running around. And now let go of any heaviness in your calves, your knees, the thighs, any heaviness or tightness in the muscles and bones. And as you exhale, let your legs drop gently onto the surface where you're resting. Now take your attention to your hip, your lower abdomen, your intestines, your stomach. Breathe in a calming energy, soothing all the organs in this area, creating space for more expansion and change. Now gently breathe into your upper abdomen, your mid back. Observe the muscles, the bones of this area. 
Going down and down and down, relaxing them furthermore. Gently observing how the spine is now relaxed and if there's more possibility of relaxation then let your body go further and further more into relaxing state. Take your attention to your rib cage, your lungs, your heart, the muscles around your rib cage, the shoulder blades opening a new space, new pathways for energy to travel easily and effortlessly. Let your breath reach every corner of your rib cage, into your heart, into your lungs, into your shoulder blades. And now drawing in a deep breath, take your attention to your shoulder blades up to your shoulders, your collarbone, your right arm, right bicep, elbow, wrist, your right fingers and its fingertips. And now focus on the totem that you're holding in the middle of your palm. Observe how all the energy is getting transferred to this totem easily and effortlessly. Feel the touch, the roughness, the smoothness of this totem on your skin and see an energy pulsate out from the center of your palm into the totem, only letting go of anything that is not serving you. And now just thank this totem for constantly helping you to release anything that is of less value to you. Now take your attention to your left arm, left wrist, palm, the muscles, the blood flow in this area and observe how this arm is now ready to relax. Let it fall gently into your lap, relaxing both arms and letting go of any tightness or heaviness in them. Take your attention to your neck, your vocal cords, easily relaxing them, letting go of any tightness you had been holding on for speaking something to anyone. And now focus on your jaw, your teeth, unclench your teeth and jaw, letting it hang and loose. Now focus on your ears, the muscles around it, relaxing all these muscles, reaching further into your scalp, inside of your brain and effortlessly letting it go of any tightness, any stress that it believes to be true. Take your attention to your forehead easing the nerves here, easing the muscles here. Bring upon a smile on your face. A smile in any situation opens path to new opportunities, creating new space in your face. Letting your mind know that everything has a solution. And now observe your eyes, relaxing them and allowing them to shut deep. For, for the next few minutes, you will choose to only look within and let go of anything that is not adding to the value of your life. Now take your attention to the tip of your nose and watch how air goes in, circulates within your body and comes out and at any given point you can take your attention to your breath to bring your awareness back into yourself 
disconnecting yourself from anything that is no longer serving you. Become aware of your base chakras. Your root chakra located at the base of your spine that is red in color. Then your sacral chakra two inches below your navel orange in color. See them connected to your solar plexus chakra on which you worked yesterday. Right below your rib cage but above your navel yellow in color. See how these chakras are now functioning. Are you able to connect with them? Are you able to breathe into them? Are you able to see if they are spinning perfectly? And from there, extend the synergy that they are holding now into the center of your chest, right in the middle of your rib cage. This is your heart chakra, green in color, that holds or controls the way you react to any new situation in your life. And observe, is there any patchiness that you had been storing in this since childhood or even from a last week or from last year that keeps you tight or heavy in this area. Take a deep breath in, breathing into the center of your chest, bursting out any energy that is no longer serving you. Allow yourself to say, heal the hollows of my heart. Breathe in another deep breath again into this chakra saying, heal the hollows of my heart. And observe, is there any patchiness, any emptiness, any spots or murkiness that needs to be cleared? Are you able to breathe fully into this region? And now we will begin with our mantra, Ahim. And with every Ahim, we will allow the energy that is no longer serving us to be transferred directly from the center of our ribcage into our right arm, into the totem that we are holding in our right palm. Let's begin. Ahim. Ahim 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 Letting this energy travel in your heart, releasing, vacuuming out any more memories, thoughts, heavy energies that are no longer serving you and transferring all of that to your totem. Allow yourself to release all those episodes when others have hurt you. For they do not know of how to operate from that place of love that you required. Allow yourself to see the goodness that you stored in your heart when you were born and believed in it and then operate from the same place 
to openly connecting to the world around you. When we choose to hold our emotions back, when we choose to hold our love back, we are not holding it back from others, but we are cutting ourselves away from the love that we can access. Allow yourself to see the childish self of everyone around you. Allow yourself to forgive those who have wronged you. For holding on to the grudge does not serve you or them, but keeps you stranded on that episode forever. Allow yourself to receive love from everyone in any form, beginning from the nature around you. Receiving the love from the sun for its warmth, its life, the moon for its serenity, the trees, the air that are constantly nurturing you. Focus on what you can receive from anyone that is trying to connect to you and release the standards or expectations you have caged yourself in. Relaxing your heart more and more. Choosing to move forward in your life. Remembering who you were as a child when you were born into this beautiful world. Opening up your heart to new changes, new ways of loving and caring. Becoming true to your real wishes. Becoming true to your intentions. Clearing out any heaviness that you had been carrying for years. For it is the disturbance in this that causes anxiety. Allow yourself to release all of this in your totem today. And begin by receiving the love that your body is giving you constantly by healing you, by taking care of you, by operating subconsciously and taking care of every function of your body. And now continue with the affirmations. See your heart chakra, your nahat chakra spinning clockwise with green energy. Say to yourself, I am now connected to my heart chakra. I let go of all the past hurts. Peace be with the people who I have ever got in touch with. Peace be with me. I forgive all for they did not know what they did. I forgive myself for holding on to whatever I did not need to hold on to. I allow myself to speak and see my truth. I allow myself to disengage from the thoughts of the world and believe in the true love that I have stored within. I operate from my greatest point of view. I allow myself to express my heart, my love, my wishes, my caring. I allow myself to heal the hollows of my heart now and daily. Taking another deep breath, restoring the balance in the center of your heart. Thank your heart 
for beating perfectly for all these years and giving you the gift of life. Thank your body for keeping you independent and letting you relish the joys of life and living. Thank the family that you're born in for they have taken care of you when you were too little and incapable to take care of yourself. Thank the nature that is constantly nurturing you and choose to connect with this nature to guide your further actions. Allow yourself to learn the art of loving through the nature that surrounds you, that gives you unconditionally, seeking nothing in return and blessing you with the greatest gift that is the gift of life constantly. Allow yourself to be like nature and grant this gift of love to all those who have come across you in your lifetime, hurting or adding value to you in both cases. Let their power go with them and release yourself from their thoughts, their actions. Allow yourself to be your own individual irrespective of the actions done to you. And now breathing in this energy. And at any point of time, you wish to help your heart release anything that is not serving you. You can hold your totem in your right hand and say the mantra Ahim and you shall have the help of the world. Taking in a deep breath and bringing a smile on your face. Observing the connections now established between all your base chakras and now also your heart chakra. Pulsating with this wonderful green energy. See this energy radiate outward from the center of your chest. Every time you connect with another individual, see this green energy bubble surrounding you, keeping you protected and giving you higher vision of dealing with every situation. And radiate that green energy of love onto others. Saying the affirmation, I am worthy. I am content and complete. I am powerful and loving. I am grateful for all that I have, all that I am, all that I can be. And now, slowly absorbing this energy in your body, ready to come back to your consciousness to your physical world as I count from five to one. On five pulsating with this new energy, all charged up, ready to give love and receive love in perfect balance. Four, more aware and understanding of your emotions. Three, seeing how your heart chakra is pulsating perfectly, spinning clockwise. Two, wiggling your fingers and your toes. One, with a smile on your face, eyes open, wide awake. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. So that was to balance your heart chakra. When our emotions are controlled and we are aware of which emotion means what, we are better able to understand the situation that is occurring around us, releasing our cause of anxiety, releasing our stress, regarding that situation. Continue doing this practice as much as you can and see you check back for the next day's practice right here. Namaste, wish you a good life.